guys welcome back to my channel so as you guys can see i don't know if you can see but um i got a camera and i'm really excited because i actually invested my money so that i could get see this is what is bad i'm looking at the i'm looking at myself i should be looking at the camera anyway let's try this again if you guys want to know more about the camera, I could probably do a separate video on that. But today, I'm getting ready to go to Las Vegas, actually in a few hours. So, I'm going to do kind of like a get ready with me right now. But this first video, it's going to be multiple videos. Um, but this first video is about the new wig that I got. And I've had it for maybe about a month now. Um, I don't know if I'm focused. This is why I'm a little. I don't think I'm focused this entire time. Okay, I don't have time to deal with that right now. But anyway, this is a U part wig that I got off of Amazon. Another Amazon wig, and it was pretty cheap to me. You know, anything that could get under $200 is considered cheap to me, honestly. So I got a 20 inch um, U part wig and it's in kinky straight. So it's like supposed to really match, you know, black girl hair texture. And so far, I've really, really been liking it. So I just kind of wanted to put y'all on. I spent my own money. This is not sponsored or anything. So. I've only had like one sponsored video, so anything I get is with my own money. And I didn't want to, you know, do like an unboxing video or any of that because I wanted to actually show y'all that I like the hair and like that it's decent for me. So, yeah, this was about $118. So I'll link everything down below, but I'm going to do my hair right now and let y'all see how it turns out. So I have my hair braided. Look at the bitch braids. <laughs> In terrible braids because I cannot braid. There's a piece out that I left out for the part to cover up the part. All right, so I just wanted to show you guys the inside of the wig. So there's some clips that go around and then there's um, these like strap things. And as you can see, I put it all the way like at the end because I have a really small head. So just FYI, like if you have a small head, it's a little bit big, but I'm used to that to be honest. I look a mess. And I made it like a side part. I'm gonna clip it and then I'll be back. Okay, y'all, please bear with me because I'm still learning. It's really hard not to look at myself so I could like see what's going on. But this is what the hair looks like clipped in. So it's clipped in all around here and I left like some hair out and this is like the part that I left out. Um, as you can see, I think this is like 1B, like natural color. So my hair is way darker than 1B. So I feel like I should have gotten like a one or like I should dye it black. But Nobody has time for all that. And it doesn't look like that. So once I style it and everything, I feel like it'll be good. And also, this hair is really soft. I really like how soft it is. And the crazy thing is, like, my boyfriend thought it was my real hair. And he saw me take it off at night. And he was like, that wasn't your real hair. I was like, no, it's definitely not. So it's definitely like a natural texture, as you can see. I've straightened it a bunch of times. And when you wash it, it's like a really, really nice texture. Well, right now, if I just like, this is without me like straightening it or anything. So I'm just like taking my hair, not really doing much to it, but I just feel like already you can see how much it blends like with the texture of the hair like it's not a straight straight texture so it doesn't even look that crazy i mean it looks a little crazy but you get what i mean so i'm gonna curl it because we have to get ready to go to the airport because we're literally leaving in like three hours um so i'm going to style it 
and I think I'm gonna come back because I don't want my camera battery to die. I'll be back. Okay guys, so this is the final look with the hair. So I just curled it with my flat iron and I think that it just blends really, really nicely. Like, I didn't want to go to Vegas with a lace wig because it's going to be like 90 degrees. And hopefully my hair holds up there. You guys will see because I'm going to be vlogging the whole thing. But I think that this is a good wig for people who don't want to get into lace and just kind of want to start out. And also don't want to sew in hair to the head because I like the fact that I can take it off every night. Let me know what you guys think of this wig. I don't know if I said it, the brand, but it's called Dear Beauty. And I'm going to leave everything down below. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.